Well, here we are again. Y'all ready to go? It's supposed to start raining soon, then snow, so we need to get going. Y'all come on. Okay, y'all, starting to rain, starting to snow. This is what we've been waiting on. Hopefully, it's going to get as good as they say. Still got to get the wood, and then we're going to cook supper. It's getting dark a little, little bit at a time. Okay, so it's starting to get pretty dark. I've got a Ziploc bag over my camera. The snow has turned into just nothing but slush. Everything's getting muddy, nasty. So, I'm gonna get my hiking shoes off get my boots on then I guess I'm gonna get the stove together start cutting wood you know how it goes okay y'all I am struggling today for some reason I'm really having a time 
trying to get this uh, stove going, but things aren't going the greatest so far, as you can tell. Just like that right there. Okay. So, I'm going to try to get this top together. I can't believe I got that like that, but I did. That's a good sign. Hopefully. There we go. Got two more. There's one, two, Got some good snow going on here. There we go, looking good. All right, now this time, Oh, look at that, man. Oh, heck yeah. That, now that's the way I like it, right there. Oh, heck yeah. Look at that. That one didn't quite make it, but almost. Just like that. This is going great. Now. All this in the tent now. It is snowing, y'all. It is awesome. They say we're supposed to get six to 10 inches. A couple places said 12 inches. I don't believe it. I've never seen that much snow around here. <sighs> but we will see. We will see. Gonna do this one other load of wood and then we're gonna go in there and start the fire and get to cooking supper, I think. Oh, so now this is what we're hauling into the tent. Got a lot in there now. You gotta have to stack it nice and decent when I get in there. Whew. So beautiful out here, y'all. This literally is just, this is like a dream come true right here. Beautiful, love it. Okay, so I already got me a new little saw. This is it, got this from Menards. It's got a little thumb press on it. Locks in place. This one I have a feeling is gonna work a lot better than my last one. <sighs> My last one ended up, I went too cheap. I mean, cheap is good sometimes, but not always. But this is gonna work pretty good, I think. Cutting me off some kindling here. Yep. It's gonna be good stuff, man. Good stuff. I'm ready to eat. I'm getting hungry. I don't know about y'all. Remember me telling you? Carbon monoxide detector. Got to have one of these. Put the battery in. It's going to squeal loud. Let you know it's working. So, put that back on. Got a little pocket here in the tent. I stick it in. If I can spin you around right here if I can do it with one hand just like that there she is okay let's get this going
Gonna just keep building this. All right, that thing is packed with wood. I'm going to get my skillet. I'm gonna show y'all that it's definitely snowing. Still not a lot, but it's starting to pack up a little bit or accumulate, I mean, which it wasn't before. Before it was just mush. So I want you to look at how beautiful this campsite is. Tell me that's not beautiful right there. That is a postcard right there, man. That is so beautiful. I got my skillet in there. Got my food in there. I'm fixing to start cooking, but I looked outside and decided I better get a shot. This is just beautiful. I know I've said that a million times, but my goodness, this is beautiful. Look at that. This is amazing to me. So amazing. I don't know why, it just is. Thank you, Lord, for your creation. It's so beautiful. Man, it gives me such peace. Happiness. It's beautiful. Okay, let's see here. Let me grab my, grab my groceries. Got me some taters and onions. Oh, yeah. Oh, and there's my jalapeno. Told you last time I forgot it. I didn't forget it this time. Here's the main course. Two little steaks, which I don't normally like steak, but it sounded good. Here's the... uh seasoning right here there it is oh uh, we got some sizzle going now I think I may skip the tater tonight I'm just not a big fan of cooking taters they take too long you know I should have brought some bell pepper but here's my onion got me some onion here I'm gonna try to cook it with the steaks I don't know if that's a good idea or not but I'm gonna do it how's that looking mmm that looks good and then, oh man, ain't nothing better than this. It's good, good stuff right here. Mm -hmm. Jalapeno. I'm trying to make it where I get a, a some and ever, ever bite. You know what I'm saying? This ain't a sharp knife, just in case you were wondering. It's like it cuts food really good, but it doesn't really seem to cut fingers or anything, thankfully. Ooh, yeah, got us a nice fire going. Look at that thing, it is burning. Heck yeah. Snowing like, well, not like crazy, but it's snowing pretty good outside. Can't see it too good in here. Oh yeah, and that's what I'm talking about right there. That's some good stuff. Look how hot that uh, pop is. Look at that. I got that thing hot, y'all. That is some hotness right there. That's awesome. That is awesome. It feels so good.
All right here, let's see what we got going. Oh yeah, that's looking good right there. Look at there. Hmm. I'm cutting it all up at one time. It's all good, done through and through. Make me some coffee. Bet y'all know what I'm gonna do now. Oh, 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 oh yeah. I'm still eating, but I'm gonna get my coffee going. First things first. Water. Dead gummit. Okay, here we go with the coffee. Hazelnut. Mm, it already smells good and it ain't even cooking yet. Okay. Now we need to put it on the stick. Ouch! Boy, that got hot fast. This thing is hot, y'all. This thing is hot. Woo! Lord, that was hot. Mm. I'm gonna have a blister now. Now the top. Yeah, there we go. It's good, y'all. Ain't nothing like a meal with jalapeno. Mm. So good. Okay, so I decided I'll go ahead and cut up some more wood. <sighs> I'm waiting on the coffee to boil. And uh, just to make sure we got enough to get us through the night. Here we are, y'all. Get the perkin. Never did get my lumber pile needed, but I will. Maybe. <laughs> Isn't this beautiful, y'all? Okay, y'all. It's ready. Uh, here we go. Wait, I think I see something in that coffee cup. I don't want in there. Okay. Here we go. Oh yeah. So perfect. My batteries are getting low in this light. Okay y'all, so before bedtime, I figured I'd take y'all on a quick walk through the woods. Look at that tree. Covered. It's deep down through there. Uh, I've been trying to save my batteries because I want to have battery in the morning. And they're getting low. But there's there's what the trees look like. So beautiful, man. Look at that, y'all. My socks and pants is wet. <laughs> and it's nice and warm in this tent. Ah, this is amazing. I'm fixing to take all this off. Put my booties on. My little piglets are smoking, y'all. What's weird is they don't feel that cold, but apparently they are. And the heat in the tent. <laughs> ah, there we go. Just like last time, there's my booties that my daughter gave me. It's weird, y'all. I'm hearing all kinds of noises out there. I'm hearing the snow hitting the tent. I'm hearing branches break off of trees because they're getting so heavy. It's kind of a weird feeling. Well, it's that time, y'all. We made it through another day. I 
think it's a little after 10 o'clock. Still snowing outside. Got the fire behind my head. It's nice and toasty in here. Very cold outside. So we're going to make it. Thank you all for coming along. As always, thank you, Lord, for keeping us safe. Thank you for the creation out here. It's so beautiful. We'll see you all tomorrow. Good night. So it's still night time. I think it's almost midnight. But there's so much snow falling off of the branches of these trees above me. It's it's very loud. Um well, I got a bunch of it. I thought a whole branch came down. <laughs> so, that's making a little, making it a little hard to sleep, but hear that? That's just a little bitty one. It just, it keeps happening constantly. There's no telling what it looks like outside. Anyway. I'm going to keep trying to get some sleep. I just put more wood on the fire. You can see it or not, but you can hear it. Good night again. Morning, y'all. That was a pretty good night. Oh, I think it's around 5.30. Yeah, around 5.30 in the morning. Slept pretty good. I uh, kept the fire going all night. It's still going. Stayed nice and warm. So, uh, it's pretty cool. I think it's, uh, I think the snow's over. I think it's just dripping, melting already. I don't know. I'll have to get out in a little bit and look. Anyway, we survived another night. Ooh. I just some coffee on. See you on a little bit. Well, here we go. With the coffee, if I can find it all. A little bit of coffee in there from last night, but that ain't gonna hurt nothing. It just give me a little extra. <sighs> After I drink my coffee, I'll take you outside and we'll see what happened through the night. All right, we're outside, y'all, and the snow did stop, and it's already starting to melt. I think. Um, we're gonna go for a walk, see what happens. Let's go. I was just gonna take y'all down the trail a little ways. Get an idea of the snow. In the Ozark Woods, Branson, Missouri. Beautiful around here. I just love how that looks. Okay, y'all. There's the coffee. She's ready. Okay, y'all. I decided to go ahead and try my eggs. Using my leftover oil from last night, it looks like it might get too hot. I don't know. We're fixing to find out though. Scramble me some eggs here. Kept my eggs in the tent in a corner. Try and keep them cool. But, but not, uh, 
not cold, didn't want them to freeze or get over hot. So anyway, there we are. Okay, I had to switch to my spoon. Hopefully this will be good. Or... Yeah, I had it a little hot, I think, but it's gonna work out just fine. I'm not really a breakfast eater anyway, so this is gonna be plenty. As far as salt and pepper and all that stuff, <clears throat> there was plenty in the seasoning from the steaks I cooked last night. And I left the pan out in the snow away from my tent in case there was animals. But I left the grease in it intentionally. Okay, we're gonna get that off of here and try to eat it. Here we go, y'all. Eggs. Nice and hot. Man, it's gonna be another beautiful day. As soon as I finish this, I'm gonna take you for one more walk around the woods since since it's getting daylight where you can see gooder. So we'll head out in just a minute. Okay, so, oh, drank all my coffee, ate my eggs, and now I'm going to take y'all on a little tour. Okay, y'all, I'm back at camp. <sighs> gonna start tearing her down. I'm gonna go inside first, start folding everything up, packing it up, and then we'll deal with the stove. Okay, let's get that stove out. So I learned last time, I remember, before I dump this thing, I need to get this door off and set it aside. I also need to get the rest of this off. It's a little warm, so I just had to do it outside the tent. Makes it a little easier to uh, jiggle around. There's that. 
door's fairly hot. There we go. So there's the drawer. With all the ashes from the night. I'm telling you, this thing burnt all night. It did such a good job. I wasn't sure about the stove when I first got it because it's it's generic. I don't even know what the name of it is or I don't know how in the world I'd get parts for it. But I've used it twice so far and so far I'm really pleased with it. Stove's falling out of the trees. Let's dump it out. Hear that sizzle? Okay, so get that done. And I just put it all back together. Look at that. The door's still warm. I mean, Okay, if y'all remember from last time, I am not the greatest at putting this together. <laughs> but we're gonna get it figured out. Again, first thing is pull the door out. Put my little cooking plate in there. I can't see it. Just like that. Then I'm gonna put my a little black one in there and close her up. Got two different sizes of pipes here, and I can never remember. There's only one that's shorter than all the rest, that's what makes it confusing. And it's like, why? I think I did it, y'all. I think I did it. I did it. And then this goes up here. The best way to fold a tent is however you can get it in the bag. That's my theory, so that's what I'm doing. However, everything is soaking wet, and so you can't just roll it up, take it home, stick it in storage or whatever, you know, or leave it in your vehicle. I'm gonna have to wait till a sunny day and pull that thing out or set it up in my storage, hang it up, something, let it dry. Don't ever leave it in a bag for very long wet because it mildews, molds, it'll rot the material, it stinks. And you could be allergic to all the mold. So anyway, let's roll it up. Sometimes if it's not too wet, if it's just the floor of your tent that's wet, you can have a rag or a towel, kind of dry it off as you're rolling it up. There we go. Let's see how we did here. I think we did perfect, honestly. 
This one's dead. Fixing to get everything on and get out of here. Okay, y'all. Thank y'all for sharing this time with me. And just like last time, I want to thank the Lord for a safe trip. Anyway, I'll see you next time.